Oh, thanks, Eddie. Appreciate the support, man. Starting his bullshit. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm that's what I'm thinking. Someone's just feeding him D2 info. I need to go use the restroom. I'll be right back. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yes, I am elderly. Yes. Okay, there's too many nice messages. Something's going on here. You guys feeling okay? Kitty, what's up? Hi, Scott. You've been abused for too long. Yeah. Uh, Harp, thanks for the gift and sub. All right, play super trivia if you want. Does no one know this? No one know this answer? True? No, it's a river. You have to exclamation mark uh, SA and then the answer. Um, that's for uh, Spark Suit. No, that's the wrong. You guys are silly. The super trivia. Like the Yukon or I don't know what island is or river. Yeah, the Yangtze. <laughs> the Yukon. There. Exposed. Uh, minimal minimalist. Thank you for the eight months. So what this does is it allows me to store a shine spark, that's it. Because if I have blue suit, you can't hold run. And if you can't hold run, you can't make this jump. And if you have less than 130 HP, you need to farm drops. And if you farm drops with blue suit, you, then you have to do a gravity jump. So what you have to do here is it's like a double frame perfect trick, essentially. There are some variations to it, however. Um, but yes. Oh, nice drops, dude. Um, I mean, this game is too volatile to expect close races. That's just, it is what it is. It, you can't expect it, but if it happens, it happens, you know? Like, it's better to expect that the race will be like a clear winner going into Torian, you know? Than for it to be like a nail biter. Since, yeah, it's pretty unlikely. Yeah, I mean, I don't want to race that close either. That was scary. All right, I'm going to do no reset run.
You run out of missiles? Yeah. Pretty much. What was what? I don't know about that. Uh, Alexander, Alexander, thanks for the uh, eight. Uh, hour and a half. A Niv, I had a big PB the other day. Fucking clown. Uh, Cointown, thanks for the five gifted subs. Fun tune with the super trivia. Wait, uh, College Town is a shortened version of the name, uh... What? In this western state? The fuck? What, Montana? Do they even have a college? Some western state. How many western states are there? Like two? Utah. Damn, sheeples. You... Oh no, you, you guessed it right. You had to do the SA. Nice, okay. I did get a good workout in, yes. Wait, no. Oh, shit. Never mind. You didn't get it. Damn. Close. Alright, so I'm gonna do no reset. Uh, I forgot to open fun tune. Hold on. My hands are very stiff and cold, so I need to force myself to do no reset here. No. It's me and Cutie. It's the semifinals. Okay, so there's kind of a confusion because of the brackets. I know Chad has pointed this out too. So this could be considered semifinals, and I'm calling it semifinals because it's easier to say than round four. So because there is um, grand finals. So this is semifinals, um, finals, and then there's grand finals. Winner, yeah, there's winners, but yeah. Why is uh, Funtoon dropping so many um, super trivias? DK, I've been doing longer. I've been doing this longer than you, all right? Trust me. What do you think I'm gonna... You, you think if I lose, I'm gonna start fucking freaking out? <laughs> you guys are stupid. You're coming into this, uh... You're coming into this about eight years late, all right? Thank you.
Um, about 20 minutes before the race starts, I'm going to be, um... I'm going to be muting myself. I want at least 15 minutes to try to, uh, just zone out. And, uh, really just cut out distractions. But yeah, still got a little bit. Yeah, yeah, I, I saw Glove is doing great. We'll see. Confusion, thanks for 22. Yeah, Glove is doing really good, though, for sure. Oh, really? Nice. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I, um, I've already came to terms with the fact that, you know, there's a good chance I could lose. There's also a good chance I could win. I say this is a good, uh, this is a toss-up, you know, but I'm not going to be bummed if I lose. There's still lower bracket, and even then... It's all for good fun. And, um, you know, I want to be a good sport. It's all for fun. So I'm playing a little slower right now, just kind of warming up my hands. Admiral Thank Vortex you. tipped $50. Your playthrough of DKC2 really helped me through my sick week. Much thanks. Good luck in the race. Hold on. Hold on, I didn't see the donut. Thing. I will check this on the elevator. No, there'll be a restream. I think I'm going to lose my mind with um, all the questions, so I might close chat um, like 15 minutes leading up to the race, but we'll see. You know, why is an Oats talking? Um, when is Oats racing as I'm in the middle of a race? Um, 24 7 live updates per second. You know. Did somebody tell Oats that he's muted? Uh, Admiral with the fifty dollars. Thank you so very much for the fifty. Guys, Oats isn't talking. Is he depressed? I'm pretty sad too lately. I get it. I saw the message. Thank you, Admiral. What's up, Albert? I got one K on you. Yeah, okay. If I win, you give me that 1k, right? Thanks. Not gonna lie, it's pretty cringe that he's muted here. You know, I'd have to read comments like that. Yeah. Daniel, thanks for the uh, host. Appreciate it.
Yep, I missed one ledge grab. QD takes a five second lead. Oh no, this is a disaster. A train wreck. <sighs> you know, <laughs> I'd have to see that shit. Can Oats make this millisecond up on QD? I know we just left series station, but. Fucker. Oh, you sound like a German guy? Do I sound German? <sighs> Oopsie daisy. Alright, we're treating this we're treating this like the race. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, dude, no. Plus 11. Oh, God, no. Oh, it's... <laughs> I'm making myself mad. Just imagining you guys. I got a bad case of the valley. <sighs> yeah, that's the haircut. It's not like I make fun of chat all the time because they are annoying often. Where are your patrons? Doesn't that mean that you like pay me? Isn't that like a transactional thing? Oh. Uh. Nah. Thank you. Barely missed the stutter. <laughs> All right, we're getting the slow slow out of the way. My God, dude. Getting it out of the way, that's fine. Probably. I probably will hit another slow, slow during the race. If I get that slow right there, I'll probably go for the uh, one round. Completely whiff it and then lose even more time because I can't get a two round. Probably what will happen. It's on the uh, sheet who's commentating. On the schedule. I believe it's Eddie and... Uh, uh, who else? Yeah, I need hockey. It's a good combination. 
that he's a bit more informative. Hockey's pretty, uh, you know, pretty hype. He's a great commentator. Uh, Vipirion, thanks for the full year. This should let you commentate, huh? Sub fourteen. Yeah, no, I don't think so. Sorry, Albert, if you're still in here. That ain't happening. Thank you, King. Thank you for the nice haircut. Is it? It's a uh, seven ET is when that is. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just going to try to, you know, once a month. Yes. So if you do uh, crate before, the problem that you have is um, you don't have speed boosters, so you lose a pretty good chunk of time just from that. And then you have to farm super missiles going into um, Meridia. So normally when you do Crade before Meridia, you are farming mini Crade twice and you get some drops from Crade. And then that sets your Botswoon fight up. And then, um, you know, it just basically allows you to not get shafted. There's a couple different reasons. Thank <laughs> you. 
Uh, cit uh, Citricorn, thanks for the uh, 16. Thank you. So the reason you need Varia, it's explained by OTBot, is um, yeah, Oats grabs Varia to survive Mother Brain Rainbow Beam with only three energy tanks. So if you don't grab Varia, you need six energy tanks, and that's obviously it's quicker to grab one item than three. Thank you for the luck. How are you done? Yeah, about an hour, yep. How was that going? Yeah, I'm just doing like I would in a race. I don't care about the time. I'm just I'm just doing a run, you know, warming up my hands. But pretty cold right now, so getting them loosened up. I'm getting my brain ready. Yeah, it's going through the motions. Well, if he wants to take that risk, he wants to take that risk, so. If he wins by six seconds, I wouldn't have won anyways, because it's only about a five second save. So. Uh, a little nervous. Kind of like nervous uh, excitement. I'm, I'm pretty excited for the race. Should be fun. Uh, yeah, I'm in winner's bracket, yeah. If I win this, I do a best of three with Zost. If I don't win this, I go to losers, and I have to uh, win two, and then I have a losers final. And then if I win that, then I face whoever the winner uh, of Cutie and Zost would be for a best of three. Yes. Mm, not entirely, I mean... You guys say that, but you realize the best race time so far is not from Zost. It's from Zenny. Uh, 41.56. I got a 42.02. Um, Ruya has the second best with a 42.04 or 5. And then um, Zost has a 42.28, I believe. It was a race against Zenny. not to say, I know Zost is going to have an amazing performance for sure. Um, we'll probably see a very good time from Zost in the finals. 
with the best two out of three, but yeah. I'm just saying, a lot of people need to realize there's a lot of talent. And um, if I do lose, QD has a great chance, you know. so annoying. You're dead in one shot. No, I was just trying to get that one shot off. <sighs> Not terrible. Not really. Thank you. careful about that if that happens I'm gonna be absolutely doing this strat to wait so I'm just gonna practice that now because it's uh, for a setup I do like double O M, yes. Doing good. How are you? What's up, Birdie? Frankie, thanks for the 30. first then press down.
Hold in Albert. Us GGs. No one ever wants to pull the Albert. This is what I call pulling an Albert. I was trying something kind of different with that um, on morph there. Um, yeah, I was just trying to like uh, shoot my missiles through the rocks essentially, which is kind of a bad idea, but I was trying something a little bit more risky there. Thank you, Rek here. I mean, you can, but it's pointless. A little low. Ah. practice this even though I'd probably just escape come on there we got it okay I wanted that yeah I'm missing all the strats on purpose yeah uh it's seven o'clock Carmen, thanks for the 47.
Damn, you guys got scammed. Plenus, thanks for the eight. Some of the uh, super trivias are kind of scammy, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> Thank you. Like I said, around uh, 640, 20 minutes before the race, I'm going to actually just be muting myself and focusing. And um, yeah, I want to try to get into the zone a little bit. And uh, yeah. Thanks, Zenny. <clears throat> ah, no. I'm chilly. My hands are cold. Like, they're just not warming up. Yeah, this is just a no reset. Kind of took some, uh, kind of did some dumb things for testing purposes. This is the uh, missed crate quick kill. Just kind of, uh, just getting a run out of the way. Warming up my, my brain. Yeah.
got it off. <sighs> if I would have approached Mother Brain, I would have saved that catch-up phase. But I was too afraid to... I almost skipped that last catch-up phase because of the super missile. Uh, Danan, thanks for the tier two for 23 months. The approach is risky. I would have definitely gotten off if I approached, but... I'm all set, everyone. I'm all set. Not a clue. Now I've been wearing these undies for the last four days as is standard. Nervous? Um, I don't know if I'm more nervous than I was for my Ruya race. Ruya, it's kind of hard to say. Like, I feel like I'd be more nervous for, like, let's say, uh, Zenny than I would for Zost. Because I know how Zost is going to play. And I kind of have, like, I have a decent expectation, you know of what to expect, but with, like, Zenny or Ruya. Um, like, I didn't know how good Ruya was going to play, and he's obviously insanely good at the game. So I was like, ugh, I just... Yeah, I don't know what to expect. Yeah, I, I did watch the race. Ruya unfortunately died in the, uh, in the attic and brought it back, <laughs> like, quite a bit. was actually fairly close at the end. Yeah, Ruya's comeback was, he was on a mission. It was a very good, 
uh, attempt. It was just unfortunate. Well, I mean, I, I know what to expect with Zost. So I just, like, I would play in the hopes that I can play good and closer to my PB, you know? But if I play against, like, Ruya or Zenny, the expectation is I don't need to play as well, but I don't believe that's the case because someone that's... Uh, because their expectation is they have to play better, right? So it's just, it's like a weird dynamic. You know, because they're playing better to try to make up time if they think they're the underdog. I am playing maybe a little bit more uh, loose or conservative because I'm trying not to die. I, I think I can beat them or people expect me to beat, you know, it's just something like that. The only thing that he had me with room navigation, land mana, I've, I've watched this race a couple times. The only thing I messed up with my room navigation was some some major tricks. I don't think I did much better than Ruya in some of the bosses. Uh, you know, like my Fantoon was clean. However, Ruya got good luck and almost got a, a nice clean two round, you know. And then, um. It's just like little things. I think, I think I played well. Um, segment to segment, that's that's what made me uh, come back in that one. Or or tornado. If it weren't for uh, me going for a five jump, going for you know insane movement, um, I would have been super far behind. But since I played well, forty minutes other than just one chunk of RNG, you know, you can say. Say what you will, but. Uh, what's your biggest area of concern? Um, not really too much. I mean, I think I'll play well. We'll see. Well, I just, you know, when people say that, it's kind of like. It, it, that was, that was like one, one portion right but that didn't the only reason that looked like it won the race was because we were neck and neck at that point after i brought it back like insane my taurian was nuts other than other than the the mother brain shit yeah i made up time literally everywhere else um all right let's see here About 40. Come on, jump. I can hear you. It uh, stores a uh, shine spark for me. Editors out. Why so serious? Okay, that's an easy ass fucking super trivia.
I don't know why they're happening. There's a reason. I think Funtoon is glitching out because of the uh, practice ROM. Damn, say goodbye to your kneecaps, man. I mean, honestly, chat, let me, let me uh, remind everyone. If I play well and I'm happy with how I play, the outcome is whatever, okay? Uh, Cutie is extremely good at the game. And if Cutie wins and I play well, Cutie deserves to win and that's it. Simple as, I'm not gonna let it affect me in any way and I'm gonna continue doing my grind until I hit my goal and I'm still gonna uh, go through the lower bracket. That's it. It will not affect me. It will not affect my motivation in the slightest. It will not affect how I play in the lower bracket in the slightest. Let's see here. Say what you will, but you know, I'm the one performing, not you, Candy. So. <laughs> Well, I mean, there is a, there is an actual reason you don't want to have a mentality other than what I just said. There's even studies that show that, uh, people that are like worried about financial gain with a um with a performance perform much worse so i've already accepted my my loss i've already accepted my zero dollar earnings uh teaching thanks for the two months Right, the point is I'm not stressing out about that. I wouldn't want that. I'd rather Cutie beat me than not show up. I want to I want to race regardless. But Cutie is already streaming, so he's showing up. Cutie ain't scared of me. His PB's three seconds faster. He's a pretty god gamer. He's good. Yes, there will be commentary. Eddie is commentating and Hockey Towner is commentating.
Thank you, Shino. Thanks for 51. Nope. Don't want to hold L there. Press L out there. Um, how do I shine spark? Like, how many taps, or what do I do for the spark suit? Because I have a tutorial on that that I'll refer you to. Or if someone can... I think we have a playlist. Oops. The whole story in a charge for the shine. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I have a tutorial on uh, Spike Suit. Possible to say, right? Oopsie daisy. Uh, you know what I want Tasters to find? A way to um, keep. If you like jump in the air with blue suit. Hold on. If you jump in the air with blue suit and then you're landing, you can somehow like store a shine spark as you land like some crazy like frame perfect shit that requires like you know when that would be a sick ass tech to be found jumping with blue suit and then somehow landing and then keeping your shine spark or it'll probably never be found because the way the you know there's restrictions and stuff people have already figured it out but yeah, I'm not talking momentum keeping, but there's probably some like weird shit people will find. Oh, what is it? What does laser stand for? I mean, I assume it's um Yeah, there's what there's one thing it can be.
Fuck that one up. In the race, I'm probably just gonna set it back up. Um, I'm probably gonna turn around in the race. Because I don't really want to change my setup for that spark or the uh, the, the X Factor. Standing behind me? What? Oh. Jeez. Aniv, what the fuck is that? Aniv rocking those 2013 emotes. Hey, Ta. Uh, I still gotta talk to you about all that stuff. Sorry. Do you have a way of, um... You have a way of timing doors then, too, right? Door transitions? Like, door transition times? <sighs> Subzost. Or, uh, funk. Whoopsie daisy. We'll just pretend that's, uh... We'll pretend that this is all normal. Thank <laughs> you. 
How did I want to miss? That's a GG, fellas. Hold on, I just want to get this robber frame here. during the race and then I'm gonna be uh, a minute behind when I fall into the water hit cutie with that <laughs> Yo, no hard feelings, cutie. Oh, just kidding. Got it. Psych. Uh, functional monkey, thanks so much for the tier one. All right. Um, wish me luck. Uh, moderators, I probably won't be looking at chat. Um, yeah, I'll be back. Uh, one second. Give me a moment.
All right, goodbye.
Test. Pretty, pretty bad on my behalf there. Uh, yeah, I know I was pretty close up until Meridia for me. I, I just butchered Meridia, so. off to cutie the machine Probably a good idea. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me yes. about what was going through your mind, the Turian, in 
that mother right to fight because we so, were freaking out. <laughs> 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 so at about shot 36, for some reason I thought she was about to catch a lead. You got lucky it didn't. Yeah. Now, I was gonna say you got lucky that it doesn't. Uh, what can happen is if you hit, get hit by the bottom, it can uh, damage boost you backwards and higher, and then the next one hits you, and then that hits you higher, and then the next, you know, it's like a chain reaction. So, yeah. Air juggled by Mother Brain Two's onion rings, but then, cutie, that pattern with kind of the 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 kind of mid catch up with the onion rings and you have to run forward to dodge them oh like, my gosh that final how, catch up how did try. Them? that that was an annoying too because i was like shot 60 and i'm pretty sure i missed <laughs> shot 60 and it was like i was just like you gotta be kidding me man like i was this i'm this close so you're gonna make me do that still oh my uh. gosh with style and panache cutie incredible but oh it's you looked razor sharp too unfortunately meridia meridia is just so so punishing sometimes yeah it, um just you know thing after thing happened and then at that point i knew it was a close race i had peaked at the restream a couple times but um yeah after that i just said eh, you know this it is what it is i'm if i'm missing these tricks and he's getting them he he deserves to take the win because it's you know just just little things here and there that cost me really so uh but overall i, I felt pretty happy about the run and um pretty much just that meridia is what uh really did it in for me there but other than that i uh feel happy about the win uh cutie played amazing so hats off to him and i wish him the best of luck in the finals before uh grand finals yeah the winner's finals that is for sure for sure oh, so yeah cutie advancing to the winner's finals to face the winner of the first semifinal match that was Zos Zenny. That was last weekend, I believe. So it's going to be Zos versus Cutie in the winner's finals for a spot in the grand finals. But Oates is not out of the tournament speed gaming. Oates will be facing the winner of, I believe, Sloter's Aussie tonight. Yeah, and I know we got to start uh, getting these matches done. So whenever that happens, I'm I'm ready to go. So, yep. um, But yeah, it is what it is. And I just told myself that um, it, as long as I feel satisfied with how i played and for the most part i do other than just that one segment so um i'm i'm happy and and like i said um i'll just do my best in the uh in the lower bracket and yeah we'll see how it goes for sure oh, for sure He's such a good competitor such a good sport has so much sportsmanship in these tournament settings we definitely look forward to your next race whoever it's going to be between Sloters and Aussie. eddie correct me if i'm wrong though Yes, it will be against the winners of Slaughter vs. Assy, which we're going to see on this channel, uh, I believe, an hour from now. <clears throat> so definitely take a tune into that one. It's going to be uh, fun, and uh, we're going to have a lot of matches coming up in the next few days uh, between a lot of these players here. It's going to be very exciting. Yeah, well, no question about it, no question about it. thank you, too, for commentating. Really appreciate it, and hopefully the uh, race was somewhat entertaining, uh, entertaining until the end there, of course, but... Time. Uh, it, it sounds like uh, Cutie made it entertaining again at uh, Mother Brain. Oh, I, I'm definitely oh, gonna yeah. watch that back. <laughs> you did. As I open, I open the channel. I open the. Uh, I open the speed like gaming challenge. Uh, yeah, I open the channel and I just see like everyone sweating, and I'm like, Cutie must have done something. <laughs> you know, I, I I just needed to know if I was uh, gonna win by default or not. So if I needed to play it safe, oh my but God, yeah. yeah, I'll have to watch that one back. Incredible stuff, incredible stuff. But we still have, I mean, besides tonight, we have another primetime match right here on the flagship station, Speed Gaming. Aussie versus Sloters in the bottom bracket. Runner-up is packing their bags and leaving the tournament. Winner it gets to face today's runner-up right now, Oats and Goat. But we still have Lynx versus Glove. This is Zos, and then we have the grand finals, Eddie. This tournament has been sensational. <laughs> Absolutely. I actually have one final question that I want to ask Cutie, uh, kind of regarding his uh his upcoming matches coming up. Yeah. Cutie. Uh with this win, 
you do take home a pretty good chunk of the prize pool. <laughs> I have to imagine you're quite happy about that. And you are going to be going up against Zost. At this point on, it's going to be best of threes onward for you. How are you feeling about your victory today overall? And how are you feeling about your upcoming matches? Um, I'm excited to do a best of three with Zost. I think that'll be fun. Um, I, how do you want those scheduled? Do you want us to do all three at once? Or two and then one. I'd I'd honestly prefer to just like set aside an evening and just do three. But yeah, we we should be doing three at once. Okay. Yeah. So. But yeah, I mean, <laughs> that's gonna be exciting. You feeling uh, you feeling nervous at all for that one, or are you feeling like pretty good going into that one? Uh, I mean, I think similar. I think I feel similar to this one. I think when there's, gotcha. I think Zos might be is the favorite in that. I think in this one, since there is no clear favorite, um. I wasn't as nervous. I was explaining this earlier, but like against like Lynx and everyone else, um, I felt like it was the onus was on me to like not make a major mistake. So mm -hmm. then you start playing really scared instead mm -hmm. of just like nervous, which is never good. Mm -hmm. um, so in a more even match, I was I think I was able to just calm down and, and live with the result because like uh, again, I run this I run this time exactly as is, and like Oats can beat me. And I'm really happy with the race I ran. So it's, it's a little bit easier to like live with the result when you're playing someone more evenly matched than you, I think. Okay, excellent, excellent words well, from, uh, excellent words for our challenger for uh, Zost in the winner's bracket. Uh, hats off to you, Cutie. Excited to see your future races and congratulations on your win today. Thank you. Massive GG's to both runners. To every runner in this tournament that has participated and that has gotten this far, Eddie, because like we said, a lot of action and a we're just we're just ratcheting up the competition, Eddie. Every round, every race just gets tighter and tighter. I think I'm good to leave. I think they're wrapping up. All right. What's up? I didn't know when I, I didn't know when I could leave. Um, yeah, I mean, I can't really complain. I just uh, didn't play Meridia well, you know. That's that is what it is. Also, uh, Major the Storm, get that shit out of here. I look over and I see, uh, this is what happens when you only play up to Fantoon. <laughs> Just talking shit in that channel. Literally, I look in that channel and I see I see viewers in here that just talk shit on me. And then I and then and then afterwards they're like, oh, oh you did your best, dude. <laughs> it's like, fuck off. Get out of here. Yeah, it sounds like the normal chatter. Yeah. Hell yeah. How the hell you got a 4122? If you never got past Fantoon? I don't know. I just, just that's a, that's a, that's a hate comment. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, it is what it is, though. And uh, yes, fortunately for me, I do make it past. Uh, I do make it past uh, Fantoon. Unfortunately, I just didn't nail those tricks. That's it. Um, what did uh, what did Cutie get for uh, for Fantoon? Uh, D Pen, thanks for the tier two for twenty three. Nah, I just noticed uh, slow fast mid. Oh, okay. Probably balanced out then. I just noticed whenever we have these races, there's people that just talk shit on me. So I was just, I looked over, I was looking to see where Cutie was in Torian. And I'm like, come on, man. Yeah. Uh, 
Ah, thank you. Wait, is my shit up? Yeah. Thank you very much, Zenny. Let me get to this. For the 1,000. Uh, GG on the race. Sorry about Meridia the loss. Uh, really proud of you, though. Uh, yep. <sighs> Thank you for the 1,000. Um, yeah, it is what it is. Yeah, I can still make grand finals. I just have to uh, win my matches now. That's it. Yeah, I um, I was uh, I was playing quite well. Your decks 1,000. Hey, Oats. GG on the race and sorry about Meridia slash the loss. I'm really proud oh, of you is. though and I'll do my best to meet you in the loser's bracket. Chin up and keep pushing man. Yes, I'll never financially recover from this. Guys, I'm not doing this for money. I was in this before the prize pool was 14 grand, okay? Um, Melt Cat Amy, thanks for the seven. Yeah, I should have just said it. On my way to the, the learner's bracket. Um, I don't think the drops were that bad, were they? I don't know. I know I uh, took a couple uh, slower strats just to farm some health, but I don't think my drops were that bad. Thank you, Eddie. Thanks for commentating. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it is what it is. The, um, I don't know how that, uh, Batoon particle missed. No idea. And then, um, yeah, yeah, that, no, that Meridia lost me, what, 40 seconds? It was, uh, it was pretty bad. Look to me, you went uh, too far left. Or Norwood. Norwood the Great. Water Serpent. Norwood the Water Serpent. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Um, I played fine. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna be upset about it, like I said. Yep, I'm going to yell Norwood next time. Am I going to review the race? There's not really much to review. The last time I reviewed the Ruya race is because that one was entertaining. Um, I mean, I hope this one was entertaining, but... I mean, it's just a series of unfortunate events once I hit Meridia because... At that point, I'm, like, in my head about it because I, you know, mistake after mistake. I'm like, ah. And then, like, I missed the door to the full halfy. My setup is different to the full halfy. I hit the door trying to just even get the the halfy. I was like, <sighs> I'll probably watch it tonight. I mean, I could. You almost died? All right, let me open it up. All right, fine. Jeez, I'm getting to it. Holy cow. Well, I I imagine I pulled ahead at uh, LN. And that must have been it. Um, I don't know, but we got to start scheduling matches fairly quick. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, let me see here. Uh, oh, yeah, so I messed up at... Um, oh, because I went back to farm a little bit, too, because I wasn't comfortable with my health. Let me open this up. Uh, 
Uh, thanks for the 15. All right. All of them. Dump them all. All the X factors. That's a three X for Cutie. That's what that's what Cutie wants. Cutie typically doesn't go for the four X. How many will outs get here? I think he only entered two with three power bombs. He would have had to pick up more. Oh, it's with four. Four X factors. Oh, <laughs> really Hockey's really, funny. Really He's hyping it up. I mean. I, yeah, so I assume I pulled ahead here. I'm just gonna like skim through this. Uh, I assume Cutie went 20 and. Oh, sorry. Cutie grabbed the wave missiles, right? Very important trick to nail. I just we just have to hold our breath. It's a tough trick. And here we go. Cutie's first up. Yeah, I assumed. Where's the spark? Doesn't get the debuffs. Oh, okay. That's that's anxiety inducing so, for Cutie right there. Oh. He's going to have to do a backup gravity jump right here. Um, that's fine. Uh, as long as he didn't miss the spark. If he missed the spark, that would oh, be really bad. Yeah, that's I start. would be sweating. Oats gets oh, the lava spark. Oh my god. Oh my god. Just like that. Yeah, so that's like, that was my biggest concern. Um worst broom in the game. The theater we still got to reduce the lag as well as get drops missiles too those are some not We're going to have to do a very specific manipulation wait cutie got missiles as well this, this giga. the double kick <laughs> oh we got it wait, i gotta see this well. and now we're gonna i'm just skimming through this favorite trick potentially hockey one of them this is it one of them i mean they're all my favorite let's go the <laughs> oh, okay that's the one time oh, there you go that's your entertainment for the double evening right there you heard a double rainbow, Eddie. That was double Kago. Double Kago. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the different octave there. I absolutely wanted those extra health drops. But okay. <laughs> Cutie just rethinks the lead. Cutie retakes the, the lead. On the farm attempt from oh. Odes. Yeah, I was struggling there. I didn't want to take the extra damage, and that's what led to that fight. Uh, let me see here. Oh, yeah, he pulled ahead pretty good. I don't believe it either, but I've got to say. Uh, uh, Oats got really hooked up with the super missiles, but I feel yeah, like I don't feel like my RNG saying, was. Uh, the super missiles are great, but I feel like you'd be the most comfortable if you really just got a ton of health from midly. Honestly, I would've, yeah, I was. I would have preferred health. I was nervous uh, at that point ahead, because I didn't get any health really. That. That's beauty as you'll ever see, like in your lifetime. <sighs> right there. Let's see if Oats can get through it too. Oats can take one. Oats. Oats. Just one. We got two. Sorry. Yet. Sorry. I hope you don't yeah, mind. I mean, to I just Eddie. want to uh, skim. From ARC. Same thing for it was Oats. your Meridia RNG. I was like blacking out at Meridia. Hold on. Yes. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it was miss, Norwood's miss fault. Right from Oats, the excellent extra jump. So yeah, I did a jump there because my health. Um, what, what the situation is with Cutie, and this is when it went I down the shitter. No, if this is the time to be playing safe. Pretty good. Cutie does have a very. That's kind of okay. And but this was really kind just of, oh, no. fucked it up, man. Oh no! I thought that was oh, it too. I thought I had oh, enough. No. But that wasn't the worst there, thing. Uh, but I knew yeah, that we were close, so I. I was like, damn, that's that's, that's, that's not that good. Gonna, uh, and then um, it. ten and two is not With good. Really good resources either is almost no, certainly gonna no have to farm. Farm. But Cutie's uh, already into the precious room on his way to Dragon. Breath, yep, and then this was just, just yeah, just just skip past like this. It's game over. Oh GG's. Oh my god. And gets spike. Recovered with the two additional supers, gets the two round, and secures the spike. There's Eddie, a real cutie, came here. GG's. Win, <laughs> and this is he's about. Yeah, that's that's when I knew I lost. Ten minutes away from after Botswoon. Yeah, I knew I lost. I think Oats is gonna be able to get this two round right here. Yeah, that's a perfect round. Wow. No blue yeah. though. He's gonna see if he clutch that the pisses me suit. off right there. I I couldn't oh, fucking the get this scrape. Got another attempt before he's gonna lose some time here. One more try. All right. Yeah. So, so at that point, I was like, yeah. Had to get past the call, see him. So PG. QG taking a pretty four four is really not that bad. No. Starting like you know PRKD high level time. Uh, and then crazy. what? My RNG was bad. Yeah. And if you skip, we got here. I mean, this was pretty bad. Go wrong, and we just have to wait yeah, there is. until they there really finally. Is. This did lose me about <laughs> seven seconds. I cannot believe so. this drop luck though for Oats. Like two yeah. supers off of three bug farms. Like that's just. Gosh, like throw oh the guy a bone, gosh. please. <laughs> He's got Thanks, full Hockey. health and two supers. That's... I don't believe it. Like on the cartridge, like come on. Thanks, That's Hockey. Yeah, throw me a bone.
Yep. The Metroid. The best. Oh yeah, I didn't get any. No, I didn't get a super there. All right, I want to watch. Uh, Here we go. We got uh, uh, Cuties Torian. First of the Metroid rooms in Torian. That's good. Dragging them along. Nice grouping strat here from Cutie. All right, the supers. Th those are some okay drops. He was kind of hoping he'd just get massively hooked up. That's not good. Oh, that's Cutie's not good. Oh, that's. that's I mean, that's good to see two there. They got, so got a go. decent amount from that first one. Oh. Ooh, but gets flashed by the second one. 20 and okay, 7. 20 and 7 going into 4. That's what I had going into that's 4. Unfortunately, I had to miss a I mean, it was my own fault, yeah. though, that I had 20 yeah. and 7. No question about it. Has to get at least, what, two? At least one? Nice. Okay. Oh. And then the back of no, the That's, that's a good strat. QD also gets the Rinka D boost. Uh, has a, a little, saves a little bit of health right there. Uh, normally you would uh, deboost off the hunter, loses but, like what a second at the expense of uh, couple health. A more conservative entry, uh, but also very fast. So here we go. We have the Metroid rooms for Oats. Well, if everything we would have been the same, yes, it saved. But an arcane strat, if ever there was one, I'm gonna hold my breath. You ready? It ended up saving his run in this universe, right? One more jump for sure. The reason I say that is because everything changes once you oh, change there anything. There we go. Cutie nails the baby skin. Know. Gets through just oh, fine. Yeah, that was, that was, uh, that was a six jump. Uh, he definitely could have done... Ooh, nice, okay. nice Metroid strat for Oats. He, uh, the, the baby yeah, wasn't at that point, I knew I was just having fun. Now, the question I knew is, I couldn't win unless uh, Cutie died. So. Saving here. He does have enough of a lead where he could maybe consider doing that to, to ensure safety on a double KO, but Cutie's not Yeah, room three was good. He's going to go straight ahead and... Yeah. Oh, oh, missing the Zeb oh. skip. This oh. is dangerous for a lot of reasons. Oh, oh no, this Zeb is a disaster spying. right here. Is that not spying? This is real dangerous. The Rinka, gotta have the Rinka. Okay, that's scary. Oh, okay. Cutie Takes a little dip in the acid. acid. That can be a, so not that can be a disaster. Yeah, Cutie losing a little extra health here, so that's always a little scary. Oats with the baby skip. Oh, it's got the jump rope clearing away that moss. Six jump for uh, Oats. Through. Okay. Through. So, okay. Cutie needs yeah. to survive. Because I, I looked here to see, Cutie just in case if he, like, died, I was going to try to, like, play it safe. But I, I looked and I saw the chat just going crazy. I was like, oh, man. And I saw he had 19 HP. Could treat you very poorly. Less RNG. Such good patterns here. So what did he do? He counted the 36 and thought ketchup was coming out. Ketchup comes out at 46. Oh man. Oh, it's low. Down back Zebs get perfect execution. Heading into Mother Brain one. No spawned Zebatites due to that Zebs. I had some pretty nasty patterns as well from Mother Brain this here. This is a pretty aggressive Mother Brain too. Yes, yes. And then just stop. So as soon as I say that, just just grinds to a halt, Eddie. Yep. As if on cue. Yeah, so now Oats into the same fight. It should be coming up right here. Oh boy. Cutie employing some good maneuvers. Gotta watch that catch up. Able to avoid damage from the meatball. Oh my, oh my gosh. God. Oh, How did he not oh, die wow. from that? He still got it. He still, he still got, got it. He's gotta watch this up. Oh. Able he to got so oh, lucky oh, that he. He's alive. Oh wow. Oh boy. This kills Cutie you. Some good gotta watch that catch up. Able this this ends damage. runs right here because oh, it pushes oh you upwards. Oh, he's alive. Oh, I don't know how he's alive right there. Got Holy it. shit. He's, got he's got to watch this upcoming catch up. And whether he cannot cannot I'm saying I even with the damage skip, I'm saying what happens there is the onion rings push you backwards and up and lift you. I'm not saying I, I know like his his skip in this instance oh, saved. There's the first catch up. Okay, but so. Kind of Normally, reset, reset mother brain in that position, get into a good shooting pattern. Keep those, oh, yeah. keep those charge shots tight. Oh, he yeah, must have been shaking. I'm clutching my chest here. I'm clutching my chest here. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, the onion oh my gosh. That oh, was an impossible pattern. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> That was scary because <laughs> that one more onion ring, he would have been fucked. He would have had to like jump up and ball. Incredible. A real no, you don't. Oh, it's this chatter knows more than you. Uh, for oh, yeah. Stop talking. What we saw <laughs> yeah, <right there. laughs> hockey's throwing up. Oh wow, hockey! I'm shaking from and that one. That was <laughs> insane. Oats now at the ketchup phase. 
having this complete as you control. Move, as you will ever see in a mother brain too. Bree and Ark both got the 4205 exactly in their race against you. To succeed. That's a hard barrier oh to beat. Gosh, Fuck. I can't perform that well twice in a row. Shit. Dodging those catch-ups artfully and now about to get rainbow beam with perfect health. Man. Oh my gosh, Eddie. I can't yeah. stress enough. Good shit, though. Oops. Nah, it's all good. Getting through that mother brain. It's all good. I mean, what, am I going to be sad about it? No. Uh, yeah, I just basically got to wait. Yeah, so it's chat. Don't be, don't be sadder than me. All right. If I'm like cool about it and I've already accepted it, you know. Yes, corn crow funded. Don't got to wait long. Your next opponent is 90 minutes. Well, we still got to set up the match. We'll probably play midweek or something. Yeah, no, this is massive. This tournament has been a blast, and um, yeah, cutie cutie deserves a win. That's it. Simple ass. On the plus side, uh, I use you as a guinea pig to test new and more accurate room timings that can even uh, explicitly include lag frames. And... Nice. Well, I'm glad to be the guinea pig. I don't see how this is finishing because after the winner of the next race, I'm scheduling my race against uh, Aussie or um, uh, Sloters. So. Yeah, no, it's awesome. It's fun. But like I said, it's all good. It's all good, fellas. You know, I'd say I let you down, but um, I didn't because I'm the one doing the work. But thank you for being supportive. And um, we still are in the uh, learner's bracket. So we still got that. Um, but yeah, it's been fun so far. Um, I think I'm going to chill because I kind of want to relax, play some Apex maybe tonight on Wind, and uh, watch the race and then schedule that uh, next race. So, I don't hate you. I'm just going to relax. Yeah, guys. <laughs> I'm just going to chill, homies. <laughs> but yeah. No, seriously, I appreciate all the support, and um, you're all awesome. Thank you. Uh, we're still going to get our goal. We're still going to bust out our goal time very soon. And, uh, yeah, thanks for hanging out. I appreciate you all very much. So, uh, Go watch the Aussie Sloters race, because that's who I'm playing next. So, peace. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all tomorrow. I am running tomorrow. So, peace.